Hey guys, before you watch this video, I just finished it. Quick disclaimer. So I got text messages like this the other day and pictures and videos like this. saying where I got my koi from, all of the koi there currently are doing really bad and sick and are starting to die. So I kind of got concerned. I didn't really act upon it because my koi was stressed out when I first got it, but it looked to be a lot more active recently. And uh, then, well, what happened today happened. I wish we could have prevented it, but all of the koi weren't doing very good. And I can't necessarily tell you why, but I just wanted to let you guys know kind of the backstory that this fish didn't just die. Nothing in my pond tried to eat it or attack it or anything like that. I just happened to get a sick fish, I guess, and it's unfortunate. Of course, we're gonna get another one because every fish in my pond is doing amazing, except for that one. So uh, it was really unfortunate, but uh, yeah, hopefully you guys enjoy. So. If you guys take a look at the pond, the koi isn't in there. I came out here, I looked through the window and I couldn't see it. And I was like, guys, turn the camera on. I don't know where the koi is. Whether like a, a bald eagle took it or, or what happened, but it is gone. I haven't really checked much yet, but not in the skimmer. I don't understand. Let me turn the waterfall off. Because maybe he can get back underneath that waterfall. Check under here. Man, there was nothing wrong with this fish, too. I knew we should have brought out the camera. Yeah, no, he's, there's nothing, there's nothing wrong with him. Every other fish in here is doing so good. The gar, the oscars, the bass, the bluegill, the perch, the, everything is doing so good. Yet this guy, that's so sad. We just got this fish, too. And you know, the weird thing is, is Dennis, if you guys watched the video where we got this koi, let me sun it down real quick. Dang it, I, I thought like this video was gonna be like my koi disappeared, like somebody pranked me and like took my koi. Because of course, I mean, like I did that when I was at Paul's house, I took Thumb um, and like pranked him. But no, no. At least I mean, I didn't have this fish for too long, so I didn't get like a, like attached to it. But that's just, either way, a fish dying is never good. I've never really had fish dying here other than Amblam. It's probably the saddest thing that's ever happened to me. Uh. Yeah. So the weir the weirdest part about this is is Dennis, the guy who gave me all these fish, his koi are doing really, really bad apparently. I've been getting videos and pictures from contractors saying his koi are not doing good. So I don't know if there's something wrong with the koi that he got because this isn't one of the koi we rescued. This is one of the ones a lady gave to him that he decided to give to me. So I'm guessing there's just something wrong with it. We're going to bury him though, so. Sorry, little guy. Where should we, uh, where should we? we over there. Are we over here? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Dude, this is so sad. Oh my god. Dude, this pole does not want to be dug. Obviously, this wasn't meant to happen. Pole is not working right now. Nope. Alright, do the honors. Yep. There he goes. Dang. Well, all right. Yeah, I don't want to. I mean, I don't want to be like uh, really, really upset over this because we didn't have this fish for long, and I was really, really skeptical when I got pictures and text like this from Cole. These are the texts I was getting. These were where I got this koi from. And that's when I was like, should I take my koi out now if he has the disease? So that's that's what I think the problem was as we just got a koi that we shouldn't have got. We should have just bought one. You know, one that I knew was healthy, had been quarantined beforehand. But that's what happened. So everybody, comment, rest in peace in the comment section for uh, our koi. He's gone, of course we'll get another one, but every other fish in here is doing amazing. So that's, uh, yeah, that's pretty sad. Um, here's a few moments we had with this koi. Oh. Yes, yeah, that's fine. probably 60 degrees. Oh, that's really Game, you're running this net. You got it. You got him. No, nope, you almost had him. Oh. Now hold on, hold on, hold on. There you go. Okay. He tried to jump out, though. You'll see it on video. Okay. Okay. 
in and good to go. Koi is good to go. Orangish, I believe, spot right there. Kind of like almost a pinkish color, but it's gonna be really nice in this big pond. Woo! It's a really pretty fish. Okay. No, 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 no. All right, we've got her and say goodbye. Woo! That is our new koi. Um, okay, so we're inside. We have a little surprise, actually. And let me let me grab it real quick. Because this happened while me and Christian were out yesterday. Let me go back here. Things gnarly. Oh, oh. oh this could be painful. Oh, oh. Okay. Oh, oh he is oh. ready to fight. Oh gosh. Mmm. Manhandle him. Bruh. Oh, you got him now. Come on! Don't touch me, please! Ah, ow! Ah! Oh, ow! Ah! Come on! Come on! I saved you yesterday! Come on! Pin him down like a snake. Ah! 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 Ow! Ow! He's on you right now. Come on! Oh god! Oh, this is gonna hurt so bad. This is gonna hurt so bad. Come on! No! 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 Ah! Is he pinching you right now? Yeah! No! <laughs> oh my god. Okay. Oh! Uh, uh, <laughs> <laughs> they so bad. Oh my god. That was an awful idea. Okay, if you go. Ow! Oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh my god. There he is. Um. If you guys didn't know. I, I, this guy, this, this guy was stuck in a storm drain yesterday, so I decided to bring him back mm -hmm. to my pond, so that's what we're gonna do. <laughs> oh my god! It was so funny. It was so painful. So, uh, yeah, this little guy, he was like, you know when water's running through a storm drain? He was like stuck on the storm drain, so I just picked him up, and, uh, he wasn't really close to like a body of water, and, uh, I was like, he could probably have a lot better places in here to hide around and stuff. So we're gonna get our little guy into the pond, let him kind of do his thing. Oh God. Oh, there he goes. Oh, right. oh God, I stepped in a bunch of ants. Oh no. Yeah, yeah, Christian, uh. <laughs> oh God. Oh, oh. <laughs> ants, please don't kill me. Sorry, bastard. Oh my goodness. All right, waterfalls are back on. Crawfish is doing wonderful. So yes, I mean, today is kind of a sad video. Um, so I'm sorry about that for you guys. I didn't really, ex I mean, I kind of did expect this to happen. I was just like, you know, it's something you, you pay attention to for a minute and then you're like, you put it aside like and hope it doesn't happen. And that's exactly what happened. I knew when I looked out my window, I was like, uh, somebody either took my koi, like playing a prank on me, or you know, it died and I can't see it and it's in the skimmer. It wasn't and it was under that rock and it just had, uh, just died. Oh gosh, Christian's playing with my ducks. You got him? Yeah. Ooh. Christian, bring that little can, we're gonna feed him. Yeah, but I'm sorry guys, I things like this are really unfortunate. I wish I could prevent them, but of course you can't prevent everything. I never really have that many fish deaths, like ever. I never have fish deaths, if I'm being honest. Like it's very rare compared to how many other YouTubers have them frequently. But uh, you just fill that thing up with some food. So uh, I'm sorry, I wish I probably should have just taken them out and see if I could find someone to like help him out because I knew I had a feeling there was something wrong after I got all those texts from Cole and everything and videos and stuff. But hey, I mean, you can't fix everything. Well guys, like I said, all the other fish are doing amazing. But yeah, big thanks to Christian for helping me out filming this video. His Instagram is gonna be linked in the description. Please go follow that. Um, I'm sorry, I can't, I can't stress that enough. But if you guys have yet to join the channel, of course, click the subscribe button down below. Follow me on Instagram at fanatic.media. Like I said, follow Christian on Instagram if you guys liked today's video. Uh, click the like button. You can also get some Fanatic merchandise at the top link in the description. Like I said, everybody go comment rest in peace for LaCoy in the comment section below. I doubt this will happen again. I just feel like it was because I got that fish and uh, all the other ones that was with it were doing bad. And I didn't know that till after I got them. But yeah, like I said, hopefully y'all enjoyed. And other than that, I'll catch you next time on the next episode of Fanatic. Peace.